Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Thanks for uh, following us along on our two days of making uh, kefir water. We had the first, which is the initial fermentation with a brand new starter. Our second video is the second fermentation, adding flavoring in. Today, we are going to see what it turned out like. Now this is, a, like I said, a very young starter. And when this occurs, when you've got a brand new starter, it can take a couple of batches to really start to get that carbonation up and going. So I'm not sure what we'll find, but I know it's going to taste good. And uh, we're going to keep doing it and keep uh, building up our uh, kefir water starter and just keep developing its flavors. So I think we're about ready to test it. And I'm going to just strain off the fruit that are in it. Let's see if I can open it. Not a lot of fermentation going on, but let's see what it tastes like. You can also get those little soda pop, the, the bottles that have the lids that, um, what do you call them, Kevin? The flip top. The flip top bottles. We have some of those. I just have to find them, get them out, and get them prepared to receive it, and then we'll try that from, ooh, there is some bubbles, guys. Look at that. We do have some fermentation going on with it. But you can use those to help build up the fermentation in it and the, the pressure in it. That's probably what we'll do eventually here. And you can flavor this with juice. You can flavor it with other fruits. You can just do the initial fermentation and call it good. Okay, let me see. So I'm just going to kind of stir it and get some more of the liquid out. I'm looking forward to this. I've had kombucha and I really do enjoy kombucha. I just for some reason felt that kefir water would be a little more refreshing for the summertime than kombucha. Um, if you guys have had both, uh, put in your comments which one you prefer on a hot summer day or if you like them equally. That'd be awesome. Just about there and then we're going to do a taste test where we have all three of us come in here and see what we think of how it tastes. And I know I've heard people, like I said, that say they, they use juice, but we're really trying to do things as natural as we can. We're, we're moving towards that more and more. And the amount of fruit it takes to make our own juice is significant. I've juiced before. Um, and I just, I don't want to buy the juice at the store. It kind of defeats the purpose for us. Um, can we set that aside? Now we're going to give it a try and see what we think. Again, this was raspberry and lime. I did use the molasses for the minerals with the first fermentation, so it is a little darker. Okay, we brought Andrew in to taste test it and see what he thinks. Ooh, that's really good. Is that mm. gonna help when you come in from working outside? Oh, oh yeah, that's good. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> Okay, good. I'm glad you like it because it's in the rotation now, guys. That's good. So we're going to have Kevin give it a try, see what he thinks. Actually, that ain't half bad. Not super carbonated yet, but the flavor is really good. Yeah, the flavor is great, guys. And like I said, as we develop uh, the starter and we uh, get it to be a more mature starter, the fermentation process should go up. We'll try using some of those soda bottles with the latch tops. That might help as well. And Actually, the flavor is really good. Yeah, the flavor is good. Get a little bit more carbonation in that, that'd be great. Yeah. So we'll keep working. We'll keep you posted on how this develops. Uh, leave your experiences, your comments, uh, anything you got to put on it. We'd appreciate it. I really wasn't sure because I know you put molasses in this, so I thought this was going to take like taste like molasses. It doesn't have any molasses taste at all. It no. actually tastes really good. It is just really good, and it is refreshing. Okay. And so we'll definitely give it a try. It's easy to do. Uh, a good way to get some probiotics in your gut. And and so I hope you try it. We thank you very much for stopping into the homestead today and joining us on this series with this uh, new uh, type of soft drink for us at the homestead, something a little more natural. 
Uh, we appreciate you joining us, and God bless you, and God keep you, and we'll see you next time.